This week, we can return to the farmer's market and enjoy a hot country night concert. We'll also get the kids ready for going back to school and do a little park cleanup. All that and more this week in Westland. After taking off last week due to the Blues, Brews, and Barbecue Festival, the Westland Farmer's Market returns this Thursday from 3 to 7 p.m. at Central City Park. All your favorite growers and vendors will be back. They have everything from fresh, locally grown produce and homemade sweet treats to unique, one-of-a-kind handcrafted items. The market takes place every Thursday through October 13th with more special events coming including Health and Fitness Day and a Fall Fest. Central City Park is located at 1901 North Carlson and the market runs from 3 to 7 p.m. Also on Thursday, we have the return of the Summer Concert in the Park Series. The next two weeks, the Downtown Development Authority and the Westland Parks and Recreation Department are proud to present Hot Country Nights. Beginning at 645 in Central City Park, you can come and enjoy a free concert from Taylor Tucky with special guests Bernadette Catherine and the Lonely Days Band, as well as a recent American Idol winner, Chase Beckham. So bring your chairs or blanket to Central City Park to come out and enjoy this free concert series. The start of the new school year is just around the corner. To help get kids ready, there's a special back to school event happening this week. The Norwayne Community Citizens Council Back to School Extravaganza takes place on Friday. Starting at 5 p.m., families can come up to Lincoln Johnson Field at 33800 Grand Traverse to see a mad science show, pick up a free backpack, and enjoy dinner and refreshments, and finish up with an outdoor screening of the movie Jumanji, Welcome to the Jungle. You can register for this event by going to the Norway Community Citizens Council Facebook page. There's some new artwork on the walls inside City Hall. The latest exhibit and the gallery at City Hall is now open and will be on display through September 2nd. The Three Cities Art Club presents From the Beginning, How I Got to Where I Am At Now. This is a solo exhibit by Eric Smith, a contemporary abstract painter who describes his work as a visual form of jazz improvisation. You can view the artwork between the hours of 9 a.m. and 5 p.m. Monday through Friday. The gallery is located just to the left as you enter City Hall. The Westland Library is once again encouraging teens to make a difference in their community with a new service project. This weekend, they'll be gathering together to clean up a local park in Westland. Teens in grades 7 through 12 who register will be provided with gloves, trash bags, and other supplies needed to spruce up the park. The work will start at noon and should be finished by 2 p.m. Teens are asked to register to participate. Once they do that by going to westlandlibrary.org, they will get more information about the program. This week on WLND, Planning Commission. This meeting of the Westland Planning Commission was held and recorded on Wednesday, August 3rd in the Council Chambers of Westland City Hall. Blues, Brews, and Barbecue Concert Series. Corey Dakota takes the stage to open up the 2022 version of the Westland Blues, Brews, and Barbecue Festival. The Wayne Westland schools are also getting kids ready for the new school year as they wrap up their Busting with Learning program. Throughout the summer, school buses have been loaded with books, school supplies, games, and more to hand out to the kids in kindergarten through third grade. The buses went to all of the elementary schools in the district and are wrapping up stops at Schweitzer, Walker Winter, Wildwood, and P.D. Graham this week and next. For more information about the dates and times at the end of the summer celebration, visit their website at www.csd.net. That brings this episode to a close. 
If you've missed anything, give WLND a call at 734-467-3198 or visit our website at cityofwestland.com. You can also follow us on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram for all the latest news and information. Thanks for watching.